He's a man who shoots from the hip, and a man who's hip when he shoots. Join me in welcoming Wayne Roberts. These are jokes. Just don't call him the boy wonder. That was nice how you just picked your nose as you said that. I'm scratching it. Your finger went inside your nostril. Oh. That is an official pick. It was only for the second knuckle. Women in South Florida are not just about the relationship. A lot of times they're just about the lay. Which is why I live here. I think George Burns is dead. Nah. Yes, he is. Nah. George Burns is not alive. I refuse to believe it. Bob Hope is alive. I refuse to believe that, too. Now, should I be tipping the line guy, too? Because I don't the, tip him, if, either. You know what? Maybe if you did, the grass wouldn't be dead. When you sneeze, you just sometimes little uh I know, and I went to a urologist, and after having such a big baby, things get all messed up. Well, that must really piss you off. Schnockered? Mm-hmm. I got schnockered on brewskis. Yeah. Buddy. You making fun of me? Not at all. Maybe it was a shark. Maybe it was Godzilla. Godzilla lives in Japan. <laughs> yeah, what am I saying? That's ridiculous. There's probably Mothra. There's plenty of women out there that love hair. Love a hairy guy. Love Ooh. to lay in a blanket. Name one. Me. Is it really all that exciting to see someone naked who's jamming out on a guitar? Is that really all that interesting? Yes, because... You never know when uh, a little penis might get tangled up in a guitar string or something. And that would be really funny and righteous during a solo. Totally. At least for me. You don't have a receding hairline, do you, Ed? Or is it or you just comb it forward? Because if you do, I can't see it. No, I don't. You will. Unless you're 15 years old, you can pretty much, you know, seeing a naked woman, is it that big of a deal? I mean, yes. you... That's what you do. You, you break the water, you have sex, and all of a sudden the baby says, I'm coming. Why did it sound like he was about to break into a song? So is that, <laughs> is that what happened? Well, I do sing, but no, I'm not. Thanks for the suggestion, Kevin, and congratulations on your baby. Thank you. Yeah, good luck with the crack. Feely men, who are always saying... Like my Uncle Tommy? Who wants you to, to you know, grasp what they're saying. Literally. Who in the hell wrote that? Bruce Valanche from Hollywood Squares? I don't know, but they're uh, all I, like that. Because I, I'm, I'm guessing that they were going for humor. Uh, I don't know. I think they're trying to... Actually, I thought they were trying to go for sensuality. Didn't work. Men in uniform stories. Men in uniform. Yes. It starts out... You know how they have like the first few words that are on the site? Zeke Heil. It's always the guys that are covered in hair. It's always the guys that have five o'clock shadows at noon. It's always the guys with the back Homer hair. Homer Simpson kind of guys. It's always the guy with a forest on their arm and their chest. And in their ears. And a jungle in their ears. It's always those guys that are horn dogs. It has, must have something to do with the follicles. You haven't said anything about me, oh, you Oh, about know. your fat ass? Yeah. Oh. And you've been putting on the sympathy weight, which is very, very kind as well. You're a heifer, I'm a steer. <laughs> you look like a grown-up Eddie Munster. Oh, nice He insult. does. Eddie nice Munster was shot. cute. No, he does. Oh, he's going to hate you forever. He doesn't have the widow's peak. And he has every right. Talk about a serious trim. What, French women? Man. Do you know from personal experience, or are you just stereotyping? You need a John Deere lawnmower. You don't even know. Yes, I do. You haven't been outside of the country other than Listen, Australia. I get a lot and read a lot of French porn. Oh. Those ladies need to take a bath. How do you know if they need to take a bath? They it's... just look dirty. I've never heard that in my life. Sewing. Sewing circle? Yeah, to mean a big gossip. I've never heard that. Ed, have you ever heard the phrase sewing circle no, meaning gossip? No, of course not. You're such a dick. <laughs> my mom told me if it was Colombians rioting in the streets, Miami would have been bombed by now. Okay, that's all I want to say. All right. Hey, Mark, you're on the air with Tara and Wayne. And my mom told me always yeah, tip hello. at the whorehouses. Hmm. Can you hear me all right? Oh, yeah. Okay, good. We well, sure can. She was going to pay him 25 grand to get her pregnant. Uh-huh. I want 50. Sorry. See, you have to negotiate beforehand. That was a lot of work, you know. You got puff fry rice? It's come with puff fry rice. All right. Pick it up a beer. Thank okay, you. Okay, get us price. <laughs> I didn't know you lived with anybody. Ladies and gentlemen, this is what I have to put up with every day.